Hello and welcome back to Cardboard Decoy Plays Magicite. So I think, let me see, I'm gonna do Dexterity. I want to play a Ranger again, or a Dwarf, I suppose. Um, that's He comes with a bow and an axe, and that's enough to get us started for the most part. Now I still don't know if you can make actual wooden arrows. Like, that would be the most useful thing, I think. Um, but we'll, we'll kind of fiddle around with it. I, I haven't actually looked up since my last playthrough, because I was like, well, I figured out how to make stone arrows, so that's fine. Let's see, stats, um, we have woodcutter, we'll keep that, we'll need that, magic we don't need though. Uh, two attack, minus one defense, we don't really need attack, we need dexterity. Hunger cap is doubled, magic, magic, uh, chance to your pick will not lose durability, and defensive. That's good enough, I like that. Alright, cool, and then what do we want? Uh, hmm, gaining three or losing one. We'll go ahead and do this, just for fun, and I kind of like that look right there so let's go ahead and continue onwards okay we're immediately going to uh, lose a hit point because of our mask and then take damage from this boar here so real great start basically uh, let's just see all right and we're gonna dance with this guy because we don't really have an escape route here all right all right cool just playing it cool here all right and all right. I'm not going to lose to, like, stupid shit right off the bat again. I'm, like, I'm adamant against that happening. Like, that happens. It's happened so many times already. It's kind of silly to kind of resist it like this. But I'm still, like, no, no. This is, I'm going to deal the, play the hand that was dealt me. Basically. Oh, my God. This is a freaking nightmare scenario. I don't like this at all. Let's try that again. Basically the same starting conditions except one less block here. So we have a little bit of a safe zone to play with. That's good. Uh, that's a marked improvement. But we still lost one hit point right off the bat here. And we have two Bs to contend with. Oh my goodness. I'm just going to hopefully not die. That's... Oh, hmm. So miserable. Yeah, and I don't know what it is with the randomization function here, but it clearly hates me. That's pretty much what's happening here, I think. Alright, and... Okay, let's just play cool here. No need to be taking needless damage right off the bat, for sure. Especially from frickin' slimes, which apparently I'm weak versus. Let's go ahead and... Yeah, that's right. Hop away. Hop, hop away. Now I'm just angry. Alright, cool. Don't play angry. Don't play angry. Alright. Let's go up here. I need just a little bit more wood, I think. And then, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and make our starting s assortment here. Uh, we need one, two, three, four, five. Well, we don't really have enough for everything, but one, two, three, four. Yeah, that's that's enough for... It'll, it'll get us started on a sword, at least. And that's pretty important right off the bat here. Alright, that's a... Uh, there we go, and a shift clicky there, and there we go. We have a real weapon, so we don't have to waste our axe on everything. And we'll just chop this pig out of the sky. I don't know why I'm dodging him. He, like, does no damage, but, uh, you know, it's it's decent practice, I guess, for the future. Alright, since I seem to have a problem with it anyways, let's just do that. Uh, okay, and then we have a blade. Alright... And a pick. Cool stuff. That's an axe handle. Alright. Oh, throwing handles! Um, man, I love Kung Fu Hustle. That's another extremely vague and not at all easily apparent reference that I made there. Not that I don't ever do that. Uh, okay. Oh, man. Alright. Plate. Cool, and I died. Well, I got a hit off right before I completely died. I just kind of alternate playthroughs, I think. Every other video is just going to be me failing miserably for like 10 minutes and then getting somewhere and then ending the video because I'm a scumbag. Uh, alright. Uh, okay. Just play it cool. No need for this to turn into another tragedy. But, uh, I mean, am I, am I the only one seeing this? These are like the worst starts to the game possible. And I just keep getting them over and over again. Um, okay. Let's... Okay kind of worked myself into a corner here. Okay. Alright. Like, not even just this game. Like, I can't imagine a game where starting under these sort of conditions is okay. Alright, fine. Let's play again. 
I'm gonna get this eventually. This is just ridiculous. All right. All right, see, now this is what I'm talking about. They're gonna start me with all the resources in the world and no threats whatsoever. <laughs> That's exactly what I need. That's the only way I'd be able to succeed at this game, basically. I, this is like whenever a Nintendo game is like, do you want to install baby mode? And it's like, no, I don't want to install. Okay, I'm having a really hard time, fine. All right, cool. So we're, we can actually make a stone sword right off the bat here with these resources. So let's go ahead and we have a pick. Two, three, four. I love the little ping pong or ping pong ball sound that you get from uh, moving stuff around there. All right, cool. Starting gear. One wooden pick, one stone sword. Like, at this point, it's basically just mocking me. Like, now it's going to throw another impossible scenario. And it's like, I gave you the best conditions. How come, why are you so bad? And it's like, I don't have a real answer for you, game, because you're inanimate. Um, not really in any sort of a way to uh, be able to talk to me that way. So I just need to stop acting like a delusional person with his video games. Uh, let's see. This is what happens, though. This is what happens whenever I'm just constantly beset by, like, ridiculous... Uh, positions that I lose against constantly. It starts to wear at my sanity, maybe just a little bit. All right, now, the real big question. Is there honestly no way to... Yeah, that just makes a sword hilt, so that was a total waste. If if I had done that, like, actually had, like, a refined piece of something and it would put it with a uh, wooden stick, it would give me just an arrow of that version. Unless, uh, like, this is real risky, but no, that still doesn't do it. I'm like, there's got to be a way to do more basic equipment, like, and be able to start using my bow and arrow faster, and I just need to stop and remember to look it up afterwards, but, hey, we leveled up, so that's good. Game gets a little bit easier, hopefully, in theory. Let's kill that guy in one hit. Perfect. That's what I'm talking about. And, uh, we've got a spider. We don't need a bow for a spider. Alright. Okay. Okay. There we go. And we got some webs, too. That's not actually going to really help us out in any particular fashion. Let me see. Does this... Yeah, it's got durability, but it's got 100 durability, so that's quite a bit. All right, we're going to get a lot of stone here, which is totally handy uh, for making arrows. And you know what? As revenge for all that stupid bullshit we've gone through before, let's just go ahead and split this stone up. Whoops. There we go. Not the best way to split it up, but there we go. Now we have 10 arrows, and you, sir, are gonna not get hit by that at all all right and we'll go around over here fortunately arrows do not have an arc to them because that would just totally ruin my ability to have pulled that off <laughs> so there we go good times getting somewhere we are now down to six arrows that's that's totally fine all right so definitely don't want to waste them i mean you get a lot per stone like actual raw stone you get uh one and a quarter and so that works out okay uh, let's go ahead and just keep chopping up stuff here. I'm going to take stupid damage. And there we go. We have enough wood to carry us for a while. Let's just actually focus on progress before the Scourge come and kill us. Okay, I, I killed something. <laughs> I don't know what it was I killed, but fortunately I killed it. Otherwise I would have been dead. Uh, which is still very much a possibility here with this wasp. Okay, cool. Whew, all right, let's see. I don't have enough for actual health potions, so we're just going to play this real cool. I was expecting it to stop on that block there like most enemies do. Most like normally, oh, functioning enemies. I have one hit point left. This is super dangerous. All right, we might just go ahead and keep moving here and try to get out of here as soon as possible and hope that we manage to find a potion on the way somehow. Okay, okay. All right. Okay, let's just... Okay. And... All right. Whew. A little tense. Just a little bit. Okay, we got a boar there. That's not real good. He's going to come right after us directly. And let's go ahead and... What, is, what does that do? I'm so angry! Uh, okay. Don't... Okay, I do a lot more damage, so that's really good. That's a plus. All right, we killed that slime and got some herbs. Now we just need to survive this, and we failed at that. Right there by the exit, too. I'm sorry I'm so bad at this game. Like, I really have no excuse. 
All right, cool. Let's. Okay, that's like whoa, took damage, and no, that's part of the the mask ability. Uh, if you can really call that an ability, I'm I'm kind of not liking it right now because it seems to just sort of hamstring me right out the gate. Um, okay, we got a spider guy. He should be fairly easy to fight with an axe. I say that, and okay, cool. Did not die. That was the important bit. All right, and let's go ahead and stop for a second and make a pick. And we need one, two, three. And then one, two, three, four. Okay. If you're wondering how I got so good at this, just look at my play. <laughs> it's not the worst play in the world, but I'm not winning any awards for it either. Let's go ahead and... Okay. Let's go ahead and play cool. It's just a slime, bro. No need to be completely nauseatingly traumatized by a slime, is there? No. No. You're a big boy. You know how to play this game. You're good at things. <laughs> we have reached this point in the game already. This does not bode well. I could make some arrows real quick. I think I'm going to do that so I can kill this spider with them. Alright. That's five. Now just don't hit the pig in the prop. Alright. That's one hit. And... You know what? That's fine. That's that's more or less acceptable. Everything's dead. That's the important information here. Oh, the important outcome information, etc. Whatever. All right, cool. And then there's some more stone. So at the very least, we can make some more arrows if we need to, which that looks like a very real possibility here. Maybe I'm actually playing the ranger class like it's supposed to now. Maybe I'm just bad at the game. Maybe it's Maybelline. Either way. Okay. Okay. I don't like that that it uses so much stone, though. That, that's my only real complaint there. Uh, if that even is, like, a real complaint. I'm just trying to delay making a sword until I can make a stone sword. That's kind of that's kind of the meta that I'm uh, participating in right now. So, if it can even be called that. Uh, okay, but it is putting me in some very difficult situations. Alright. And I'm out of arrows. That's fine. Let's just kill him traditionally with an axe. Alright. Okay, cool. And he's dead. Good stuff. HP and attack went up by one. That's real good. Uh, okay, okay. Kill the pig. Pig is dead. Jump up here. And we've got uh, more boars. Oh boy. Alright. Let's lead him off the cliff. That's what I wanted to have happen, and it didn't. So, you come back this way. And then I knock you over there. Cool. Alright, now we don't have to deal with him. Alright. Kill the slime. I mean, you really... You you only get good things for killing everything on a floor, but now I'm just trying to, like, actually make it to the next room, basically. Oh, okay. We got enough for a sword, so that's good news. Bad news is there's a boar right there. Alright, let's stop for a second and make a sword for finals. For, for realsy finally final reels. Uh, let's just do that. And... Stone blade into hilt, and we are good. Cool. Alright, now we can actually do some, like, melee damage for these slightly more predictable guys uh, that I'm still going to fail against because I mess up my timing. Okay. Alright. I just don't want to... There we go. Just need to minimize the amount of stupid shit that I try to pull here. Alright. And there's a slime slowly approaching me, and that scares me shitless. Okay. All right, cool. Both boars down. Don't die. All right, let's see what the green thing is. That is a... Uh... I did something. I, I apparently augmented my arrows, but... Nothing perceptible yet. I guess I should probably have arrows first before I augment them. But that was kind of... That was kind of worth it just to see what would happen there, I guess. All right. And... Let's keep moving on. Okay. There's another boar. Whoop! <sighs> I jumped right on top of him. Keep zigging when I should have zagged. That's that's basically what happens there in a nutshell. Okay. One of these days I'm gonna get good at this game. You're watching like really, really rough progression here, basically. Okay, this is already a pretty bad situation. Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. We might just have to run from this. I'm trying not to like just go, okay, I'm dead, and then, well, that's what ended up happening. I, I didn't want that to happen, 
but I'm still... My threat assessment is not great in this game just yet. Uh, alright. So it looks like... There's three stone. I'm trying to gauge if I can make a, a sword immediately. If I can make a sword right now, that would be decent. Then I will actually fight that beehive. Let's go ahead and we're going to kill this tree and then the pig after it. He's sad. That's upsetting. Okay. We're just going to keep moving on here. But at least the Tiki Mask did not take away my health immediately, so that's a plus. And then I'm just going over here to see if there is an extra stone nearby. There is. Okay, cool. So I can kind of backtrack here a little bit. And what I'm going to do is do that. That's a pick handle. One, two, three. Okay, and pick, oh, pick that up, <laughs> get it, uh, and actually, oh, I already have a stone bar, it looks like, that's, I wasn't paying attention to my random item that I received, and uh, I've already got something that I could use to make a sword with, as long as I can get back there, I can, good stuff, alright, so, this is actually good for a number of reasons, let's go ahead and I'll, I'll explain what I'm talking about here in a second. Let's go ahead and just do that, and we'll make a, uh, yeah, close enough, and stone blade, and there we go, and okay, so we have a stone sword, and now we can also make some stone arrows, so here's how we're going to do this, we're going to anger the beehive, because I'm a big ninny, and probably don't know my own strength or what's good for me. Alright. And... Yes. And... Okay. Kill this bee. We leveled up, so we do a little bit more damage. That's always awesome. And then... We're gonna... Be very prepared here. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, I just shot three arrows at the same time for some reason. I don't know what happened there, but that was awesome. I wonder if that had to do with the spell and I somehow managed to carry over that buff over playthroughs. I wouldn't... That would not surprise me as a bug, to be totally honest. Okay, cool. So that worked out real well. We lost an arrow there because it's... I, I still don't exactly know why it's split into three, but I'm guessing that that might have been it. If I had to guess right off the top of my head with no immediately apparent... Oh yeah, no, I got three arrows because that's part of the mechanic. I'm gonna go ahead and assume that that was a, a leftover remnant of my last playthroughs. So let's go ahead and just do that. And if that's the case, and if you miss with an arrow, it de like just spawns an arrow for you to pick up. It's a really broken way to just farm arrows. I gotta, I just want to point that out really quick so that we're all aware of uh, what I'm thinking there. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and do this. I don't know what that did. Oh, I have a, I have a, I have a buddy. What is he gonna do? He's gonna. Push that slime way the hell over there on the side of the map for no reason at all. Okay. I'm not exactly sure what the point of that was, but uh, I'm fine with it. It's not in, exactly in my way or anything. Okay. Uh, Alright, that big block only stops right there, so that's going to make this at least a little more doable. Go, Spirit Wolf Buddy! What, oh, push me into blocks and, like, kill me. Awesome. I... Don't understand. <laughs> That's both okay and terrible. Like, I don't know exactly how I feel about that. Alright. Alright. We just play it cool and we can beat these guys fairly handily. Uh, actually, let's go ahead and... Whoops. Pick that up. Pick that up. Pick that up. My stomach begins to grumble. That's fine. Just pick up the freaking herbs. Alright. Okay. And then we need to split you and make you into big potions. Same here, actually. Alright, and we're going to move you up here. Cool. Alright, we're at full health. Let's continue on our little journey here. Okay, alright. And, once again, don't know my own good or my own strength. So, we're just going to go for it. And my sword broke, fortunately. My fists alone were able to c destroy the monster bees. Alright, cool. I feel pretty good about that, but we should probably hurry if I had to guess. Alright, let's just go ahead and gather up a bunch of wood. And kill this bee, hopefully. Yes, I do substantially more damage than I do starting out, so that's really useful. 
Let's go ahead and mine this out and keep moving. I expect the Scourge to be here any second, so I'm getting kind of freaked out by their non-presence. Still want to get a bunch of stone, though. That is imperative. Okay, cool. And, ooh, right, we've got a spider thingy in our way. And, okay, we have no weapons. No immediate tool usage outside of uh, this pick, which really is fine because that's all we need to use at this point. We've got more than enough wood. We can go ahead and just kill this pig with a pick. That's no big loss. And then we'll mine this, and then we'll be fine. Yeah, turned out okay. All right, I'm getting a little tired of this forest, so we're going to go to the swamp here. And... Okay, we're going to do some item management, and I'm going to end this episode and continue onwards. So, uh, or on the next episode, to clarify there. Uh, okay, so what's our situation like? There are no animals to kill here for food, so we definitely need to eat, though. So I'm just going to go ahead and make a fire starter. And we'll put that here, and then have some meat here. Is there any meat I could buy that might be worth it? Not really. Okay, cool. So cooking food. All right, and we'll eat that food. All right, we are full up. And all right, so let's uh, gauge what we have to work with here. We've got some coal we want to hold on to. Uh, we've got stone, monster pelts. We got three monster pelts. Unfortunately, we're going for dex bonuses, so we need leather, actually. So let's go, we'll sell that. We only have two monster hides. That's really unfortunate because that's not even enough to like justify reinforcing into anything so we're just gonna focus on first of all making stone equipment so that's a pick handle and then we'll need a sword hilt all right so we've got those two we can sell these spider webs and these bones really let's do that um, yeah that's a lot of monster bones we don't need really oh I bet I can make bone arrows oh, I didn't think about it Okay, okay. Well, I that's that's live and learn. I'm I keep forgetting that stone arrows are kind of a an ever present source of grief for us at the moment. Alright, cool. So we'll just make some uh Whoop, there we go. Split that in half, make some blades, combine blades with sword hilt, combine with pick handle. There we go. That's gonna improve our ability to perform a few different things in the crafting realm in the future and then uh yeah we got refined stone we we'll use the rest of that there for some arrows and just have those on backup in case we need them all right cool so that's going to do it for this episode though in the next episode we'll move onwards and upwards and continue on to actually seeing where we can get in this game so i hope you've been enjoying if you have please consider like commenting and subscribing and i will see you next time have fun